Say my name, say my name. My first name is Marcus. Marcus is my first name. Say my other name. Say my name, say my name. My next name is Sexy. My name is Marcus Sexy. Yo, what's up? Welcome to Marcus's Corner, episode two. Back for more. I knew you couldn't resist this face, this voice, and this body. All right, I interview people from the company called The Behemoth. Which is ironic, because I don't think anyone's ever heard of them. Their name is Dan, Pilates, and Josh. John, I don't, who cares? Okay, then take it away, here's the interview. Yo, how's it going? My name is Marcus, and this is my corner. Um, okay, I'm gonna be honest. Had a long night last night. Not very prepared today. Who are... I don't know who you are. Who are you? I'm Dan Paladin. Hey, what do, do you do? I do I do art for the behemoth. So, John, what do you do here? I, uh, clean the bathroom. <laughs> Is he always like this? No, it's true. So what are you guys working here at the behemoth? We're working on Castle Crashers, and it's going to come out for Live Arcade. How long have you been working on Castle Crashers? About three years. Three years? Yeah, yeah. Oh my god. That's ridiculous. They make a new Madden game every single year. Yeah, that's Where right. is the excuse here? <laughs> what are you doing? Need, just slacking off? We don't need off? excuses. We don't need excuses. So you're not working hard, apparently. No. What we're else do you guys do? Working pretty hard. Flip burgers at McDonald's? What are we doing here? Okay, so Dan, you're an artist, so what other things have you drawn for? Uh, well, we worked on Alien Hominid before. Oh, I played that game! <laughs> Not very good. Yeah, uh, actually, Castle Crashers is, e is, a, is a bit easier. Really? It's still challenging, but when you when you die in the game, uh, you let, you still keep your experience points. So the next time you go through the level, I'm gonna stop really you right chance. there. Okay. So my girlfriend and I had a fight last night. I was wondering if you could help things out. She wouldn't answer her damn phone. What do you do when that happens? Don't look at me, man. <laughs> He's married. <laughs> <laughs> well, you want to answer the phone? Yeah, I want her to answer the phone when I call her. Why? Because I'm going to talk to her while when I call her. <laughs> oh, yeah, thank you, even John. <laughs> thank you, Dan. Thank you, but you can Pick up Castle Smashers. Um, you can smash castles, I guess. That's the game. Castle Crashers. Okay, John, I don't want to offend you, but I don't think anyone really cares. <laughs> We're into here. Later! Wow, what a great interview by me! I want to thank Dan for that great interview. John, I don't think so. You need to take life more seriously, man. It's not a joke. It's not a joke, John! Okay, we're gonna move on to the email section. We got some pretty good questions. The first one is from Ian H. He says, Dear Marcus, if you were in a video game, what type of game would you be in and why? Wow, what a great question, Ian. Okay, easy answer. The genre probably would be adult rated M for mature. You only can play it though if you're a hot girl. It's just me walking around and killing people, working out, probably doing girls. You know, something that the hot ladies would like to play. And believe me, they can play me anytime. Oh, looks like Ian said also sent in some fan art. Let's check it out. Oh, wow, look at that. Not very good. Doesn't look anything like me. Next piece of art is from Matt S. Oh, very nice. Me flying. Very nice. If done by a preschooler, Matt, come on. What do you take me for? The second picture. Is that hair or muscles? If it's hair, you're way off. I'm smooth as ice. If it's muscles, you're pretty close though. Besides the fact that it's drawn pretty shitty. The third drawing. Whoa, whoa, whoa. It's like looking into a mirror. The only problem is I don't have a regular tie, it's a bow tie. But besides that, it's dead on. Matt, take your kid away from the computer and you keep drawing because your kid's drawing sucks. Your drawing was good. Okay. Oh. Looks like we got our first naked picture from a girl named Emily. 
I had to alter the picture a little bit to make it work appropriate. Wow, Emily, your body is like a work of art. It is beautiful. It's like a work of art that someone shoved two metal spikes right through it, completely ruining the whole picture. Emily, take out those nipple rings, then we'll talk. And by talk, I mean All right, that's gonna be it for today's Marcus's Corner. Send me more fan art, emails, or naked pictures of yourself. I forgot to say you have to be older than 18 though. That's also important. Okay, Marcus at Mega64.com is the address. My name is Marcus, and I am out for this week. I'll see you later. Whoosh. Oh yeah, buy my shirt. Come on, man. Buy that shirt.